All right, guys, welcome back. Um, you may notice I'm not in the same spot where I left off before. I didn't do anything. I just went to this store. You see this? It's a little store just to pick up a few things. And that's it. <laughs> okay, so now we're going back to that place where we couldn't go before we talked to the council. So as of right now, um, this is going to be my ninth video for today. Of course I'm going to still be playing it, but I might try out the multiplayer, which if you're thinking about buying this, you should buy it new because it comes with an online pass. And I'm not sure if you can buy the online pass on Xbox Live or PSN store, whichever console you're on. but. Um, it comes with the game, so, well, obviously it comes out today, so of course you're going to be buying it new, but if you're watching this later on, whenever, well, hi, I'm John, but, um, yeah, you should just buy it new because it comes with the online pass. It also comes with a two day gold membership pass. And hold on while I get the box. This game is two discs, which means it's going to be at least what 20, 30 hours. Good for me, good for you. Win win. Except I have to get off my butt to change the disc while you guys just sit there laughing at me. So, no worries. Holy crap, where am I? I see you little kid, I got you. Slow motion for you. But I don't even know where I'm supposed to be going right now. I'll just follow him, I guess. <laughs> this part reminds me of uh one of those cutscenes in Fear 3, if you guys played it. Where it's like all foggy and stuff. If you guys have never played it, I'm just not making any sense right now. Um, I actually beat that game co-op with a friend. But that was before I had a PVR, so... Maybe I'll do it again in the future. if they, Or beat it by myself or with another friend. Or maybe one of you subscribers... But that game was cheap when it came out for some reason. I don't know why, but it wasn't bad. Liara, can I help you? I've been forwarding the Turian Counselor information on the Prothean device. It can't be built without Council support, but he's not budging until their Primarch is safe. I know. Are you all right? I didn't get what you'd call a good night's rest. There's more to it than that, isn't there? What's really bothering you? Oh, oh my god. These are both problems. Okay, guys, pick a number. One, two, three, four, five, six, whatever. The Reapers are here now. And the Council, the other races, are only interested in looking after themselves. How many civilians are dying while they wait for us to make the first move? At least the Council can't deny the Reapers exist. They'll come around. They've got to. Commander Shepard, I'm Specialist... Oh. Uh, I, I beg your pardon. I thought you were alone. I was just leaving. 
Commander Shepard, I'm Comm Specialist Samantha Trainer with Alliance R&D. I was part of the team retrofitting the Normandy after you turned it over to the Alliance. There weren't many of us aboard when the Reapers hit. I need the Normandy functional. What exactly have you done to my ship? We upgraded communications and removed most of the Cerberus tech, Commander. Meaning? The ship's in line with Alliance regs now, and it has new, top-of-the-line, quantum entanglement communicators. In fact, Admiral Anderson had intended to use the Normandy as his mobile command center. That's no longer an option. Yes, I heard he chose to stay and fight. I in any event, I'm honored to serve under you, Commander. For as long as you need me, that is. They only sent me here to... She has a British us. accent. Shepard, some of our systems require further testing, and Specialist Trainer has been extremely effective during installation. I would prefer that she remain. Got it, Edie. Oh, wait, since when does a virtual intelligence make requests? Edie's an AI. Fully self-aware. Oh, I knew it. I knew Joker was lying. Jeff requested that I pretend to be a simple VI to protect myself. I apologize for the deception. Thanks, E.D., and I apologize for all those times I talked about how... Mm, ...attractive your voice was. Anyway, shall I give you a tour? I think you'll be impressed by the new upgrades. In the CIC, you'll find the galaxy map where you can set the Normandy Fancy. destination. You can also check your messages at your private terminal. The War Room houses a strategic command center for mission-specific intel and war analysis. The shuttle bay contains an armory where you can modify your equipment between missions. Finally, Liara has set up a lot of hardware down in the old XO office on Deck 3. I think she's claimed that room. And there you are. Still the same ship as before, it just flies Alliance colors now. Speaking of which, I believe Admiral Hackett would like to speak to you at the VidCom. <laughs> Okay. Commander. Wadena updated me on your meeting with the Council. Sounds like they're running scared. Oh, oh my god. Um. We did present them with a lot of unknowns. They're feeling threatened and want immediate solutions, not theories. They are kind of useless, are though. Right now. But I'm then trying again. to get the Turian Primarch for a summit meeting with the Asari. I'm an adult. I'll bypass yeah. the council and appeal directly to their leadership. That's good. I like it. This is where we start laying the groundwork for our counterattack. Unfortunately, we don't have a whole lot <coughs> to back it up right now. Then build alliances. Gather everything and everybody you can for the cause. What about the Prothean device? Find me people who can help build it, and if you can't. I'll take ships, soldiers, supplies, whatever you can get. We need to keep hitting the Reapers across every theater of war they open. Buy us time to figure out the device. And when it's finished? Assuming it ever is, we pool all our resources. Think of it as a giant armada for delivering the device, when the Reapers are most vulnerable. The stronger you can make that armada, the better the chances of punching through. You can count on it, sir. It's not just me, it's everyone back on Earth. Anderson and what's left of the Alliance forces have to hold out until we deal with the enemy. I understand, Admiral. Good. Then make it happen, Commander. I'll be expecting regular updates on your progress. Hack it out. Sorry if you guys heard a little muffling in the background. I was just uh, fixing my headset. Ooh, okay. 
crazy lady. I feel like I should be making multiple save points just in case. It's always a good idea. So right now what I plan on doing is just talking to everyone. check on your new recruit just wanted to see how you were doing still trying to get my bearings when I was working on the Normandy's upgrades I left at the end of the day I didn't even have a toothbrush or a change of clothing until I made some emergency purchases on the Citadel next time you need something just ask we're all in this together oh it, it, it's no trouble commander I'm sure you have larger concerns we can put in a requisition order my toothbrush is a Scission Pro Mark IV. It uses tiny mass effect fields to break up plaque and massage the gums. It costs 6,000 credits. Okay. Yeah. You're on your own with that. In any event, <laughs> I appreciate you giving me the chance to stay. Was there anything else? Carry on, Specialist. Specialist. Specialist bonus achieved. Then I die like two two seconds later by a random grenade. Alright. Hey Commander, you know I had my doubts about the council. But after years of ignoring your warnings, they're finally willing to step up and tell you they just can't <coughs> help. They've spent years denying the threat. You think they'd be prepared now? I was kind of hoping that maybe they were planning in secret and just not telling you about it because, you know, Cerberus. Well, let me know if you want me to get them on the channel and then hang up on them, you know, for old time's sake. Wait, what, am I, what else am I supposed to do? Admiral Dr. Liara Tassel, Dr. Karen Chop. Yeah, I'll read all those when I'm not recording, just so I don't waste your time doing that. Wait a second. Oh, an elevator. <laughs> 